that got dark real quick. Hello YouTube, it's Balamore here, back again with more Blind Gaming and a new LP for the channel. Hooray! This one's called Slide in the Woods for the PC, of course. I'll leave a link below in the description as usual. You guys can check it out for yourselves if you would like. It's a free-to-play indie horror game. Uh, I didn't read the website before recording, but I have read it. And I think it was you're just out in the woods and you find this slide and you want to have a little fun. And it's a horror game, so... I don't know. It's probably a evil slide. If you're new to the channel, I am blind. I've got no center vision, just peripheral. So if I can do this, you most certainly can do it. But without further ado, let's do this. Press escape to change sensitivity. Oh, they're probably telling... It might just be too sensitive for people. Okay. Boop. Boop. Alright. Well, that's pretty cool. It runs fairly good. I mean, it's very, very simple graphics, but some of these, like, they as you're turning, it just shakes real bad. This one's real nice. I like the simplistic graphics, too. Pixel-style horror is... I don't know. I've got such a weak spot. I think it's because I grew up, and the first big system was an Xbox and PlayStation 1... And those graphics, I don't know, it must be like a reminiscent thing. Oh, let me turn the volume up a little more. Kind of hear just the wind. Ooh, that's an ominous noise. Oh, I bet we're like... That's a portal. I bet that's what this is. It looks the same. I love this kind of stuff when I was a little kid. can't jump. I'm just seeing if there's any. Oops. Tab will make the mouse cursor appear. <laughs> Alright, in the slide we go. Ooh. Feels like it got a little darker. Oh, yeah. Oh, and the ambience. Interesting. Starting to get a little Silent Hill fog. Eh, just keep going. Oh god, I can't see anything. That got... real very quick. What the hell was that? I got the volume cranked. That scared me. Okay. I don't know what that says, but I'm assuming it just means, you know, flashlight to light the way. Oh, so you could play in the dark if you want to. I wonder if that'll open up a uh, ending. Now, if there's an opportunity, I know we're probably going to face a demon at some point. If there's an opportunity to, d opportunity to die, I will take it just so you guys can experience that. I'll edit it out if it restarts the game. A lot of these do. Alright, still dark. Oh, we got something up there now. So hope you guys are playing something spooky. Because I usually am. Is this a missing poster for me? Okay, this is just a newspaper clipping of mass disappearances um, around a local park. As if people just vanished into thin air. Children and adults, so it's not discriminative. I'm assuming we're sliding down the thing responsible. Because we're definitely not in reality anymore. And you notice there's no railing. Wait, is there? Maybe there is, it's just... Oh yeah, there is. Just the shadows. Let's keep going. A 
below. Oh, can I go all the way up? No. Something in that pipe. Or the slide. That's freaky. Thought I heard something skittering. I think my son would really like this game. Assuming it's not, like, gory. He gets so scared. He talks brave, but it's funny. When it comes down to it, he can't handle it. I remember him trying. He begged me to buy Five Nights at Freddy's for him, so I did. I bought him one of them. And the whatever one he wanted, because some YouTuber was playing it. And he couldn't... He had have... He turned the volume off on his computer speakers, because he couldn't handle it. And that's in daylight with the doors open, the windows open. He still couldn't handle it, so it's funny when he talks brave. I actually let him watch some of my videos that are kid-friendly before I post them. So he feels special, but he has to, like, sit next to me. It sounds like it's in there. Oh, this time it's... Is it coming out? Uh-oh. That got dark real quick. So that's what's taking the people. That was probably one of the victims. Mm. All right, let's do this. Oh, this is a little deeper. Oh boy. Oh, the flashlight's going out. I knew it. Hold and release space. Oh. Oh, I see. If you do it too much, you get kind of, like, tired. Can it get us in the tunnel? Oh, I bet it can. Oh, wait. It's hold... Hold down space. Oh, this is going to add, if you're being ch you, yeah, you're going to be chased. For sure. And that thing's going to be screaming at you the whole time. <laughs> so what fresh hell did we go into? Um, should we go this way? The big chain. Nope. This is like a temple or something. There's no running. Yeah, it's like a... That's weird. So what did he do? Suck his blood out and discard him? Yeah, it's a sacrificial altar. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, it's a heart.
that's sealed off. Uh-oh. That's going to open that door. If the monster comes, I'm going to let it get us. Are you going to drop? Oh wait, this is lit. Feed them. Oh, it's it's not a heart, it's the victims. Ah, I think it's the victims. That's opening. Um, is that going to open? How come this isn't opening? I bet he can get me in the tunnel. Alright, we're going down. Here he comes. Alright, let's see if we can see him. Get a good head start. Oof. It sounds like he's like right behind me. I don't want to go up. Very nervous. God. I'm sweating. It sounds like he's right there. Okay, did I do it? It's light again. Ah. Oh, it's... Oh. Okay, guys. So that was Slide in the Woods for the PC. I really liked this game. I really enjoyed it. That was good. The monster was very frightening to look at doesn't happen often i know monsters are scary and everything or demons i think this was a some sort of ancient um deity of some sort of 
pain and torment or something but it was very creepy to look at and the noise he made or it made and the Tromson behind you and it can get you in the tunnel and the stamina system was holding space you couldn't let go of space or you ran out of crawl stamina and you had to wait and it sounded like he was real close toward the end I don't know if he sped up or anything but yeah that was really really good I enjoyed that let me know what you guys thought in the comments below did you think it was creepy just to reiterate I play alone with really good headphones cranked in absolute dark, not just like in the daytime with the curtains closed. No, absolute dark at night with the lights off, my door shut. So I'm like in it for sure when I play these horror games. So that scared me. I bet if it was daytime and I was just playing it with my speakers, I wouldn't be as scared, but that was good. So we'll move on to the next one. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Until then, as always always. Later.